Naviate contains three pipe trench sub-assemblies. The pipe trench-eng is included in the video about pipe corridor creation. This video will explain the properties for the pipe trench rock sub-assembly and the pipe trench step sub-assembly. These two sub-assemblies are very similar to the pipe trench sub-assembly, so this video will only show the differences between the three sub-assemblies. For a complete list of all settings of all sub-assemblies, please see Naviate's help section. The rock sub-assembly can handle two surfaces and has two properties for two surface slopes. The rock surface slope is used up to the rock surface and then the existing ground side slope is used up to the existing ground surface. These two surfaces can be set for the corridor as surface targets. The sub-assembly has a rock bench which clears a specified distance along the rock surface before starting a ground side slope. There is also an option to include a reinforced bedding underneath the bottom pipe. The stepped profile trench sub-assembly has a few specific features. First, it has insulation methods. Setting this to zero has no insulation. Method one gives individual insulation for each of the pipes. And method two is one insulation sheet for all of the pipes. Methods one and two are affected by insulation min cover, which determines the minimum cover for the pipes to get insulation. Method three is one hole insulation above the backfill. The insulation width is the width to the right and the left of the pipes. The bedding is individual for each pipe. The width of the bedding is determined by min cover side, which gives the width of the bedding on one side and that width is applied as well to the other side. To get individual bedding but no stepped bottom, there is an option to turn off stepped bottom. Note that the individual bedding, as well as the insulation, are not removed from the volumes for the backfill and remaining backfill. 